Hello everybody, happy Sunday. Kind of had a long night last night with Ninja. Well, first of all, Sebastian got up at like two. He was ready to party. So he came in bed with us and eventually fell back asleep. And then at 5.30 in the morning, Mr. Ninja over here got up and went to the bathroom in our bathroom. And it was everywhere. It, it was everywhere. Um, speaking of Ninja, Something I just wanted to say, we're not going to talk about it for very long because we don't need to talk about it for very long, but there's a lot of comments about people feeling sorry for Ninja and saying that he's too old and he's suffering. I don't think that he's suffering. I think he's just really old. And when people you love, including your animals, get old, you just meet them where they're at and you take care of them um, until it's very, very clear that a decision needs to be made. Um, and Ninja is not our dog, not our dog, not our decision. We are just watching him right now. And as I'm vlogging, I'm taking you through my day. Um, and Ninja is just a part of our days this weekend. So I appreciate all the love and concern for Ninja. Just know that he is very, very well taken care of. It's like another child to Gio's mom and any decisions about him um, have nothing to do with us. So please just respect that. He's He's okay. He's just old. Moving on, we have to go to the cabin today. Remember a couple of weeks ago, we were talking about hiring somebody to do a renovation on the bathroom at the cabin. It is finally done, and I think he did some other stuff while we were there too. So Gio, Sebastian, and I, and Ninja, um, are getting ready to go to the cabin. Um, Sebastian's having an issue with his G-tube. He's had this little growth, a granulation, on the outside of his G-tube for a while now. So I'm going to put some steroid cream on that. Trigger warning, if you don't like blood, there's a little bit of blood around his site. I got to take care of that. I'll show you what it looks like now, and I'll show you what it looks like afterwards. Just going to put some cream and some gauze around also, it. Also, Zeus will not be coming with us to the cabin today. I think that that's something that also comes up a lot of the times whenever we go to the cabin, especially when Gio's mom or sister come to the cabin because they always bring their dogs. You've seen them before in the vlogs. It's Ninja and Chloe. She's the little uh, French bulldog. Some families are the type of families to bring their animals with them every single place that they go. And to be honest with you, we are not that way with Zeus. Zeus is 100% content being at home. He doesn't go into, de into like a depression when we leave him. He's got free roam of the house. He's okay. Um, the only time we bring Zeus with us to the cabin is when we plan on spending the night. Today is not one of those days. We're just visiting to make sure that all the garbage is cleaned up and the renovation went smoothly. So Ninja will be coming with us because he has to. Zeus doesn't have to. So he's gonna be staying home. <laughs> this is what Sebastian's little tummy is looking like this morning. As you can tell, he's got a little bit of blood. It seems to be bothering him a little bit. He's kind of crying about it. I feel like it looks worse on video for some reason. Mm. This is called a granulation. It's just tissue trying to heal around the site. He has seen doctors for it. That's why we have the steroid cream. Every once in a while, it just flares up really bad. So we're just gonna put that cream on it, cover it up and you should be good. Okay, just got a little bit of cream on there. I'm gonna put just a little bit of gauze right over top. It's okay that it kind of goes down a little bit too. I want it to just kind of get all over that area. I know it's bugging you today, huh? Got some tape over top and it'll be Nice and good for the day. We'll get some cream on there to help, okay? I'm all dressed and ready to go. Hi, Mustard. Say good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. Say hi, you look so handsome. You look handsome. Are you sleepy because you were partying in our bed at 2 o'clock in the morning? You remember that? I remember that. Yeah, you throwing a party, huh? <laughs> I'm just making a little bit of chicken and eggs. Spinach wraps? It sounds weird, but it's like if you get a country skillet or something, you know, there's chicken in it. Um, just so we have something to eat over there. Usually if we don't bring something, then we'll stop somewhere. And we usually stop for pizza and we're trying to be healthier. So I'm going to prep some lunch for us to have when we get there. <laughs> what it looks like all wrapped up. I'm keeping it in the foil should probably keep it uh, nice and warm too for at least a little while. Nala, come here. Come here. <laughs> what are you doing?
what's in that picture? Protein, strawberries, greens. And a banana. Half a banana. <laughs> it's no wonder you're a crowd favorite on YouTube. <laughs> Do you guys hear Nella? I think she's going through heat at the moment. What are you doing? Look at these lazy bones over here. You gotta get ready to go. What's wrong? What? It's okay. This is what's missing with some pictures. Oh my gosh. Where's he going? Where's he going? Look at all that food on your beak. We're gonna get ready to pack the car. For you guys, it'll be a second. For us, it'll be an hour and a half. But we'll see you when we get to the cabin. We're here at the cabin. <laughs> what you think? We should do a lot You want to show everyone the new bathroom? Yeah. What are you? <laughs> okay, so here's an update. Don't worry about that stove. It will be replaced. So it's 99.9% .9 done. Let me find the light. So obviously we need to paint that black still, but as you guys can tell, we have a stand-up shower now. New vanity, a toilet where a normal person can sit down. The other one was like for a miniature person. Um, but we still need to do like paint. We still need to put a door or I'm sorry a light fixture Just the little things just tightening everything up. We need to put like a little trim piece So it's just the little things and of course as you guys know the little things are what takes the longest but That's done flooring is done. We still need to put up like the little trim so all around the corners um, and then he put carpet upstairs. There's no light upstairs because I'm gonna have Steph try to find a photo of the old light that they had up here, but it was rough. It was literally right in the middle, so it's hard to tell, but it was like a round globe from like the 80s. But we put like some plush carpet up here. Um, this was kind of with the intentions of it being like a hangout up here. My plans are to put like, um, I'll have Steph put a picture again. They're like TP style um beds and it'll be like little twin style beds twin size i should say twin size beds um again this will be more for like kids you could stand up here so the the, the roof is actually really tall i'll come in here you yeah you could see so i'm standing up so it's a pretty big room so my thoughts put a twin size bed on that side put one on this side and it'll be like a nice little hangout so everything's coming along good. It's just, like I said, it takes forever. We are already on our way back home. We literally just had to come here to meet the person that was doing the work so we could look at his work and pay him and that's it. And then take the garbage. I don't know what's going on here. Take the garbage from all of the construction. We literally have a bathtub, a sink, and a toilet in the truck, truck bed right now. But we just wanted to look at everything and now we're headed back home. See you next time, Kevin. We're home! Oh, you got the hiccups back there. 
Hi. <laughs> we just got back. To... Yeah, I could walk them. I was gonna show everyone the agaves that you got. Oh yeah. I don't think that I've showed everybody the new plants that we got. Hold on, I got ninja. These little agave plants. Aren't they nice? Just different, something different. And then we planted that little, hold on, sorry guys, this thing yesterday from Gio's grandma's. So we'll see. Yeah, it's looking pretty cute up here. See dad, it's chilly out here. <laughs> you got his head all covered up. Look at that. Toilet, bathtub. Yikes. All right, let's go in. It's chilly. Sebastian, are you mad at us for being in the car that long? You got a little crocodile tear right here. You mad at us? <laughs> Dad said something about chocolate pudding. Where's it at? Where's my chocolate pudding, Dad? You said I could have some. You okay? Yeah. yeah, it's mama. Look, you can tell I was sleeping in the car. I got sleep prints all over. <laughs> but he didn't take a nap. Why didn't Bogey take a nap too? Huh? Mama took a nap. Let's get you chocolate pudding. Hmm. <laughs> Here's the chocolate. No more crocodile tears. Yeah, no more. I got my chocolate. <laughs> mm. Ooh, that's so messy. Oh, big breaths. Big breaths. Is that what you wanted? Some chocolate? Yeah. That's for being good in the car. Yeah, you were a good boy. Look at that chocolate face. <laughs> he's, he's tired. Got a little on his sweater. It's okay. I'm going to put him in his jammy soon anyway. Oh my goodness. <laughs> hey, thanks for the chocolate, Dad. <laughs> Look at that beautiful face. You look handsome. <laughs> Is that so good? Chocolate boy. One more? Mm. <laughs> oh my goodness. Is that delicious? It's all gone. You ate it all gone. Mm. Yeah. Mm. It's so yummy. <laughs> Tell me. Talk to me. What? Tell me something. <laughs> Tell me. What? Come on and talk to me. <laughs> Hi. Thank you for the chocolate. Yeah, it was so good. Yeah. What? Look at that big boy face. You look older. Yeah, you look more grown up. <laughs> what, baby? What? I love you so much. <laughs> yeah. Sebastian's tummy looks a little less red red. So that's good. Looks like that cream probably 
<laughs> I'm gonna get some stuff to take that off. <laughs> but it looks like the cream helped clear it up just a little bit. What? Get put your jammies on. <laughs> Let's get this tape off. This is what we're looking like after we got jammies on. I think somebody's already a little sleepy over here. <laughs> you getting tired? Well, I think we're going to call it a day there. Both of the dogs plus Nala need to be fed. Sebastian just finished up his evening feed. I'm going to give him his medication. Um, I am nannying tomorrow and Wednesday, so I don't know how much I'll record. Um, but if anything, after the girls leave tomorrow, maybe I'll do like a part two of answering questions. Excuse me, because that's easier to do um, after they leave. Monday night late, Gio's parents get in. They get in around 12.30 in the morning. I don't know if I'm picking them up or Gio or Gio's sister. I'm not sure. And like I said, I'm nannying two days this coming week. And then we have to start finalizing Sebastian's IEP to get him a transfer to start school in the fall. So all of that stuff is coming up this week. Going to have some big phone calls, but we could talk about that on another day. <laughs> per usual, thanks for being here with us. Thanks for checking in on us. I will see you guys in the comments later tonight, and we will either see you Monday late or at some point on Tuesday. Hey, Mr. Batman, you want to say goodnight? Do you want to wave and say goodnight? Hello? Maybe? Are you hiding? It's bedtime, you know. What do you think? He says, no, mama. No, mama, no. <laughs> Can you wave? You say bye-bye. What are you doing with your nose? No, I don't want to say bye-bye, mama. No. You say bye-bye. Say thanks for being here. We'll see you soon. <laughs> All right, guys. We'll see you soon.